recovering lawyer turned entrepreneur, I had to write something. And I literally wrote it this morning, so. This is a little bit different than a thank you speech. Um, I'd like to ask a question. What's the greatest invention in human history? Some might say the wheel. Others may say the printing press. Still others may say medicine. These examples have undoubtedly, in the words of Thomas Jefferson, helped ameliorate the condition of mankind. However, there is one invention, above all others, that I believe is the single most important our species has ever created. Language. Did you know that there are 6,909 languages in the world, including various forms of sign language? I didn't know that till today. Without language, there would be no wheel. There would be no printing press. There would be no medicine. In fact, without language, we wouldn't be here this evening. Let me ask you another question. What is the most powerful force in the universe? Scientists would say gravity. Economists would say compound interest. Poets would say love. I would say the most powerful force in the universe is an idea. Page turn. Throughout the millennia, human language has evolved from mere gestures and grunting to elegant prose and complex ideas like democracy, freedom, and equality. The fundamental role that language has played in the evolution of our society cannot be understated. Language is the seed of every idea, the genesis of all religions, the cornerstone of every society, the first shot fired in every war the extended hand that brings about all peace, and the inexplicable reason why we fall in love, even though words often escape us when we do. Most importantly, language allows us to tell stories. Stories are especially important because they do more than allow us to communicate our aspirations, ideas, and feelings to each other. Stories create something that every person yearns for throughout their life, human connection. Over the course of my life, I have studied history, politics, philosophy, economics, and law. I have read some of the greatest stories ever told. I have traveled the world and wrestled with complex, complex concepts such as morality, religion, equality, justice, and the meaning of life. I have done all these things, often failing spectacularly, in an effort to better understand the human condition. And yes, to seek what we all do, a human connection. Three years ago, I was pondering the powerful relationship between language, ideas, stories, and the quest for human connection. I came to the conclusion that I could bring all of these things under one roof by creating a statewide LGBT media company. And that its mission was simple, to promote equality through storytelling. This company, now called Q Media, and its quarterly publication, called Q Virginia Magazine, which is, of course, on your tables, and please admire the what I call GQ Santa Claus on the front. It's a platform to share stories, promulgate ideas, and use the power of language to connect communities across the Commonwealth and D.C. I'm truly honored and humbled to have our hard work recognized this year. I'd like to thank Agla for this award and for the wonderful work that they do year after year in Northern Virginia. Agla is a beacon of light, hope, and love for our community throughout this region. Also, a big thank you to Freddie for hosting us this evening. And congratulations to Freddie's Beach Bar for winning the 2017 James B. Hunter Human Rights Award from the Arlington County Human Rights Commission. Bravo. As we at Q Media and Q Virginia Magazine continue our mission of promoting equality through storytelling, let us never forget the power of language, of ideas, of stories, and of human connection. As 2017 draws to a close and we begin 2018, I have one final question for all of you. What's your story? Thank you.